Introducing Xbox One. This is it, Xbox One. This system is built to amaze on day one and continuously improve over the generation ahead. In designing Xbox One, we've obsessed about every finite detail. In every engineering milestone, at every corner, in every feature, the principles we followed were to be simple, instant, and complete. Xbox on. And it's that simple. Xbox One instantly recognizes me and gets me to my own personal home screen. No more manual login, no more waiting on system or game updates. Now the home screen, as you can see, has a familiar interface. But let me point out for you a couple of unique differences. First of all, it'll remember what I was last doing. So for example, here in the center of the screen, you can see I was playing one of my favorite racing games. This one here is just one of the new, amazing Xbox One exclusives you're about to hear a lot more about. You can also see I was listening to some music by Dead Mouse and watching a movie. Now like many of you, I also discover new entertainment based on what my friends like. And for that, we create a new area called Trending. Here I get a snapshot of what uh, is popular in the entertainment world, both with my friends and with the entire Xbox Live community. Of course, I can still browse the great content I've come to love on Xbox, such as games, TV and movies, and music. Xbox, go home. Now that you've seen the start screen and home experience, let's do what millions of people do every day when they turn on their TV. Guess what? They watch TV. It sounds simple and obvious, and it should be, but today it isn't because of the need to change inputs to get to live TV. All that is going to change with Xbox One. Let me show you. Xbox, watch TV. And with that simple command, I'm watching live TV. Now here in Seattle, I'm a Comcast subscriber, so this is the programming available in my area. But hold on, let me show you how we're going to take live TV and make it not only integral to the Xbox, but also incredibly useful through a great new feature called instant switching. Xbox, game. Go to TV. Go to music. Watch TV. Yes, that fast. Did you see how instant that was? Come on, it was, so, it was so good. Let's see it again. Let's see it again. Go to Internet Explorer. Oh, nice. Watch TV. Watch movie. Switching between live TV and all my games entertainment is now as fast as switching channels on your TV remote. Now, you've already seen how simple it is to use uh, your hands to navigate through the Xbox One, but we're going to create a new set of universal gestures to control your entire TV experience. Gestures such as grab and pan and swipe up. Let me show you one of my favorites. Here's an example of how I can get easily back to my home screen from anywhere in the system. 
I simply spread my hands, grab the screen, and I'm back home. And if I want to get back to my movie, I grab, and I'm back to the movie. And again, this is not only now simple, but it makes it instant to get what you want. Now, have you ever wanted to do more than one thing at a time when you're watching TV? Of course you have. On Xbox One, the ability to do multiple things at once on your TV is now a reality. Introducing Snap Mode for the Xbox. Xbox, Snap Internet Explorer. With Snap Mode, I can run multiple programs alongside one another and easily interact between them without having to shut one down and start up another. Xbox, favorites. Star Trek. Okay, so right now I'm watching Star Trek, and I've heard great things about the sequel, Star Trek Into Darkness. So now I can use Internet Explorer and my cell phone as a remote control, for example, to watch a trailer, and I can even navigate to find movie times and buy tickets. And again, at any given time now, if I want to go home, I just grab, and I'm home. All right. Now I'd like to introduce for you another amazing thing you can do on your Xbox, Skype. Skype on Xbox One connects you to family and friends in ways you aren't going to find on other TVs. Not only will you get Skype experiences in widescreen HD with the best living room camera available, but only on Xbox will you be able to do group video calls on your TV. Let's take a look at Skype in snap mode. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and grab my movie and zoom back to it. And to help you show it off, I've asked my friend DJ, one of the members on our sports team, to call in and help me demonstrate. And right on cue, DJ calls in. Xbox, answer call. Hey DJ, thank you for calling in to help me show off Skype in snap mode. Looks like you're working pretty hard out there. Hey Yusuf, thanks for having me, I'm happy to do it. You know, it looks like you're doing okay yourself. I'm looking forward to you showing off the great work we're doing with our partners at ESPN. Well, as a matter of fact, that's what's coming up next. So why don't you sit back and enjoy it? That's great. Just make sure when you get to fantasy, you show the real version. You know, the one where I'm in first place. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Skype in call. Let me go ahead, though, and show you that Xbox uh, sports offering that DJ was talking about. Xbox, watch ESPN. All right, let me set up the scene here. Imagine I'm at home watching an NBA game during the regular season, but if you're like me, I like to keep up with my fantasy team. Now what I can do though is instead of having to pull out necessarily a separate device, when my player scores here like LeBron, I automatically get an alert that just pops up on the TV and I can say, Xbox, show fantasy. And now I get my fantasy players right alongside. Really one of my favorites here, and that stats update live. But in addition, I can go ahead and check out league standings. And you can see, here's why I passed the DJ with that score from LeBron. Always good when you're doing the demo. And in addition, I can go ahead here and I have a nice thing called featured highlights. So I can see clips of my favorite players when they've done things, even if I'm not there. So let me throw this one to the full screen. Here's my center, Tyson Chandler. And here's how he helps me dominate the fantasy league with plays like that. Always very nice. All right, now what you're seeing though is just one example of what we can do with live TV, but can you imagine what we could do with the Super Bowl, or the Golden Globes, or even with political debates with this ability to have interactive TV? All right, finally, let's tackle what I think is the biggest challenge with watching TV. Anybody? For me, it's finding what to watch and keeping up with it. Introducing the Xbox One guide. Xbox, show the guide. Now you can find, discover, and watch TV in three powerful new ways. Voice control, search, and navigation, favorites, and trending. With the Xbox One guide, I see all my local TV listings right through my Xbox. And I can use my voice to check out what's on. Xbox, Today Show. Watch Sci-Fi Channel. Watch MTV. What's on HBO? Pretty cool, huh? Let's see that again. Mary and Martha. Watch CBS. Show the guide. See how easy that is? No more memorizing channels or hunting for remote control. The next thing I want to show you is how I stay on top of all of the series that I love to follow. 
Xbox favorites. The favorites area is an easy way to keep up with all the TV shows that I like to watch. All I have to do is pin the content in one convenient place. It's a lot like having my own personal channel. And finally, there's one of the areas I like the most, Xbox trending. Trending gives me a glance at what everyone in the Xbox Live community is watching. I like how current it is, it's up to the minute. From here, I can instantly jump into the most popular shows. But trending isn't just for live TV. There's also a section for video on demand, so I can see what people are liking no matter what time zone it's in. Xbox, go home. So there you have it. The heart of that system is raw power. From 500 million transistors and 512 megs of RAM in the Xbox 360 to over 5 billion transistors and 8 gigabytes of RAM in Xbox One. USB 3.0, Wi-Fi Direct, a Blu-ray drive, a native 64-bit architecture, and variable power states, all while delivering practically silent operation. This is a modern, powerful box engineered to deliver now and well into the future. We're bringing a new Kinect sensor paired with every Xbox One, which puts you at the center of your entertainment. Kinect is completely redesigned to respond instantly to you, your voice, and your gestures. Voice is now more conversational. It's faster, and it supports the entire family. And our new proprietary time of flight measures the time, about 13 billionths of a second, that it takes individual photons to bounce off of you to create unprecedented accuracy and precision over two gigabits of data per second to understand your world. This is rocket science level stuff. Games and applications will create new experiences like you've never seen before. Three years ago, Kinect ushered in a new capability to make you the controller. Let's take a peek at the power behind the next generation Kinect sensor. We started with the ability to see your world. Now that world is crisp, it's clear and beautiful. A 1080p, wider field view capture of your world. As you saw with use of Skype call, Kinect's camera and Skype offer the best shared communication experience in the living room. In 2010, Kinect layered in an analog understanding of how you move. But in 2013, we revolutionized this capability. There are more joints. And now, for the first time, understanding the slightest rotation of a wrist or a shoulder. We understand your balance, the transfer of weight from one foot to another, the energy of emotion. When you're exercising, it can read your heartbeat. This is human control for a human experience. Now, we wouldn't bring you next generation gameplay without innovating on our controller. For the new generation, we're taking the world's best controller and we're making it better. The Xbox One controller is updated with over 40 design innovations. It features updated ergonomics and an integrated battery compartment that just fits better for gamers of all ages. New dynamic impulse triggers allow creators to program feedback directly into the triggers. And a newly designed D-pad creates precision for immersive gaming. This is your controller, designed by gamers for gamers for the next generation. And we can't talk about input innovation without Smart Glass. Last year, we unveiled Smart Glass to enable your devices to work together with your Xbox. Your tablet can instantly become a remote control and a deep companion experience. We've had over 10 million downloads of Smart Glass for the Xbox 360. But with this new generation, your smart device will behave like it's born to work with Xbox One because it's natively part of the platform. Connect, controller, Smart Glass. Innovative, familiar devices to control your experience your way. But the real magic is what happens when all of these devices work together to create all new experiences. The new Kinect sensor is the binding power between these devices. When you press power on or volume up, when you change the channel on your smart glass device, Kinect seamlessly makes it work. When you pick up your controller, Kinect recognizes you and the controller, and it gets you into your latest game save instantly. Speak, and your troops follow your commands. Raise your controller, and a virtual shield follows. Your devices work in harmony to create a lag-free, instant, and complete experience. Now, to truly evolve the next generation of games and entertainment, you need access to the most powerful entertainment service. 
The new Xbox Live is built on Xbox One to amplify an all-new generation. Based on the same membership you have today, but now more powerful, more personal, and more intelligent. When we launched Xbox Live in 2002, it was powered by 500 servers. With the advent of the 360, that number had grown to over 3,000. Today, 15,000 servers power the modern Xbox Live experience. But this year, we will have more than 300,000 servers for Xbox One, more than the entire world's computing power in 1999. Just imagine. You will now have a dedicated game DVR to capture and access your magic moments and save them to the cloud. With our native editing and sharing tools, you'll have the most amazing bragging rights on Xbox Live. Achievements become dynamic and changing. They tell your personal story of how you play, not just what you've done. You will play richer matches with the future of matchmaking and our new asynchronous capability will allow you to search for your perfect match in your favorite game while you play another game, while you watch a movie, or while you browse the web. And finally, game developers can take advantage of our worldwide multi-data center infrastructure to drive direct game computation. This means bigger matches with more players. It means living and persistent worlds. Introducing Xbox One. Xbox One, which is a god-awful name. It's just stupid. Xbox One. Hey, you gonna get the new Xbox? Nah, I'm gonna get the Xbox One. Because I can't afford it. I'm gonna get the Xbox One. Because it does one thing. Play television.